some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. We find ourselves in Newberry, Vermont today with Josh Abrams, or as I like to call him, well, uh, there's a lot of names I could call him, but I can't say him on YouTube, but we'll get into that later on. At any rate, we find him harassing an elderly man for no reason at all, but oh, just because he can. I tell you something, this idiot has no class whatsoever. At times, I think he's even worse than Glenn Serio, and that's hard to top. At any rate, let's sit back, relax, and try not to destroy our computers, because you know what? They serve us well. They don't need this kind of abuse. Come on, guys. At the Newberry Town Clerk's office. In Newberry, Vermont. We're going to be amazed by their customer service today. Hi. Hello. Hi. How can I help you? I'm good, thanks. Uh, we don't usually... Somebody oh, oh okay, life. yeah, no worries. Did you... Something I can help you with? No, I'm all right, thank you. Okay. It's interesting the town hall doesn't have a public restroom. Very limited septic. Yeah, I mean, like, I mean, it is an ADA compliance for all federal, government, county, and local buildings. So, I mean, septic issues are much less of a problem than legal lawful compliance. You know, Josh, you're the last one to be speaking about septic issues, considering that all that comes out of your mouth is nothing but a bunch of sewage anyway. I mean, they really should send a plumber to fix that uh, open leak that's coming right out of your mouth. I mean, that's a biohazard right there, I'm sure. So how long has the town not been in compliance with local, state, and federal law? I didn't put the sign up, so I can't tell you when it was put up. I just. Uh, what do you do when you have to go? Um, <laughs> you have to go I home. <laughs> I, I live well, you have here. a bathroom here for you guys. But there is a bathroom here. Yeah, right? okay. Uh, well, well, I mean, it, it would be as simple as someone saying like, "Can I use the bathroom?" And then you guys being like, "No," and then they're like, "Well." That, that's not our most recent report. But. No, that's cool. Just looking at the name. Is the is the town manager in? We don't have a town manager. Who? Uh, what do you have? A mayor? What do you have? Select person? We have a select board. Select board. Okay. Are they aware that you guys are not in local, state, federal compliance? I don't know that. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna make this pretty easy. Uh, can I use your restroom here in City Hall? Oh, so you're all of a sudden needing to go to the bathroom, huh? Did all that Taco Bell you just eat decide to start coming out early? You know that stuff's not good for you. You have to go in moderation. And you know, I try not to fat shame on my channel, but I'll make an exception for you. Because you know, look at you. All that Taco Bell has not helped your waistline at all. I mean, good grief, man. You need to stop. I think you could. See, that's perfect. That's nice of you. See, it's not your fault. We got to talk to the select board. We got to make sure just because I know there's like septic problems and stuff, and that makes sense. Like, you don't want, you don't want, you know what, to be flowing across Main Street. We're just trying to make sure that the the folks, you know, that, that the buildings, because you know, the city, I'm sure, issues fines and collects taxes and and revenue, and we just want to make sure that, you know, they're they're following the standards that they set. Oh, cool microphones. Yeah, I saw that. I'm like, damn, those are beautiful. That's fancy. Well, thank you very much. You're very, very nice. Okay. No, you don't really need to. Oh, no, no. I was just, I was just asking because yeah, I, 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 I figured you're very nice and you'd say yes. That's why I asked. Yeah. We often do, but it's just the amount of usage has to be a little bit. Can we, well, can we at least, like, maybe take the sign down? Hey, Josh, I got a question for you. Are you capable of uh, getting any kind of decent job? No. Why not? 
because of your uh, criminal record? Oh, I understand. Nobody will hire you because of it, huh? Well, now, that's your own damn fault for being such a moron in your youth. And what's a moron? Always a moron. Stealing our oxygen and making a general nuisance of himself. Can I help? I, I can help. It? I it's right here. Do you want me to take it down? Do you want me to? Okay. I don't want to, like... Here, oh, that's good, just in case anyone... I'll fold it up nice. Just There you go. Oh, Thank you so much. You're so kind. What's your name? My name is Mary. Well, the town's lucky to have you, Mary. Yeah, thank you, Mary. Okay. You're a wonderful, wonderful lady. Have a great day. Okay. Thank you so much. Well, Mary's nice. Everyone should let you people like know Mary's doing a great, great job. I do. I like Mary. Thank you, dear. Five minutes later. Power! What are you taking a picture of? Huh? What are you taking a picture of? Right now, you. What? Because you're talking to me. Who the f*** are you? I'm me. Who the f*** are you? What's your problem? Why are you taking my picture? Because I feel like it, man. What is your purpose? Uh, my business, not yours. You know what, Josh? Where I was raised, I was taught to respect my elders. And if I didn't respect them, well, there would be consequences. But I never suffered those consequences because I'm not stupid enough to uh, act like that toward the elderly. You, on the other hand, have no common decency, common courtesy, or respect for anybody but yourself. Well, go about yours. Oh, that's so grumpy. Yeah, man. Who are you? What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Who are you, bro? <laughs> Whoa, fucking idiots. Eat, sh eat, eat a shit sandwich, buddy. That's for you, man. Friendly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you know, I guess I'm glad I was rolling. What a turd Ferguson that guy was. He was like, what are you doing? I'm taking your picture of the fucking man with you. <laughs> you are so lame. <laughs> Oh, nice building. In there. Oh, I don't want to be in here. This guy's grumpy. Careful. This guy's a grumpy Gus. He likes to swear and yell at people. Well, it's names. We were friendly. Yeah. What a... He's a poo sandwich. <laughs> That's turd. <laughs> I thought he was going to hit you. I saw him coming at you. I stepped back and changed the view of my camera. Because I thought he was going to be a lot. He would have sat down real quick. See my hand in my pocket? Uh, get ready. I tell you something, Josh, you are a very pathetic individual going after an elderly gentleman like that. I mean, do you have no common decency? Oh, wait, I've already established that you don't, because you know what? You have never had it. <laughs> <laughs> Josh is full of it today. I don't know what he's full of, but he's definitely full of it. Look at this guy. What are you filming for? <laughs> Look at this tough guy. Thinks he's all big and bad and tough. <laughs> Four one one A eight nine one. Driver shame. Wanted to get so tough, didn't back it up at all. <laughs> yeah, buckle up, buddy. What are you filming me for? 
Uh, I'm not even. Normally, I'd help him back out of of his phase, but. You know, Josh, I wouldn't be laughing if I were you, considering that a lot of these older people, well, they know how to take care of business, and if he wanted to, he could probably have put you down, boy. <laughs> that was funny as hell. Grandpa comes up all hostile. He's like, what the beep are you doing? What the beep are you doing? It's just, why? Listen, don't talk about it. Be about it, Grandpa. Relax. Have some jello. Enjoy. You know, normally I'd say your disrespect toward the elderly would have something to do with your criminal background. But I know a few criminals, and they tend to have a bit more respect toward the elderly than you do. It's got to be something else, something I can't identify right now. But it, at any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video without destroying a computer, of course. So in the meantime, take care, guys, and I will see you on the next one.